Okay, so in this video, we're going to be looking at the module updater inside Apparition Net Studio. Now, this can be used to update XEX files for your games. So if you're a developer and you're wanting the latest XEX that's on the latest title update so that you can decompile it in IDA, or, you know, if you're just a regular user and you want to update your XEX files so that you don't have to apply a title update each time, something like that, you can go ahead and uh, use the module updater for this. It's much better than using XEX tool because you don't have to find the patch file and then manually patch it. This tool does it for you. So all you have to do is go on the game that you want to update. So I'm on Modern Warfare 3 right now. So we're gonna go ahead and update Modern Warfare 3. So we're gonna open the module updater and then click next. It's gonna say uh, what XEX file do you want to upload? So do you want the single player XEX or the multiplayer XEX? We're on multiplayer, so we'll do the multiplayer XEX. And we'll click next and then it'll say, where do you want to save your um, your patched XEX? And we'll just save it to the desktop. So I'll click okay on the desktop and all modules updated and I can click finish and that's it done. So there it is right here, so, oops double click that by mistake so there it is there and we can go to properties and you can see the size is 689 megabytes which is the patched version of the modern warfare 3 xcx in fact if i go ahead and open up the file manager and just go into the hard drive modern warfare 3 modern warfare 3 and i'll rename this to mw3mp.xcx or mw3mp underscore patched so whoops we'll call this one patched dot uh, xcx and then we'll take the actual multiplayer xcx the non-patched one and we'll drag that to the desktop and we'll compare sizes so you can see this one is 6.3 uh, 6.39 megabytes whereas the patched one is 6.89 so that shows that the patched one has been updated so that is how you update it much easier than using xcx tool where you have to manually find the patch file and drag that to your desktop and then get the actual xcx for the game and drag that and then use xcx tool and uh, open both the patch file and the xcx and then patch it and output it to your to some location on your computer this kind of streamlines the whole process and does it all for you all you have to do is be on the game on the on the title update that you want and it will patch the xcx with that title update for you so yeah that is the module updater in apparition net studio